Coach Travis, what was it like today? It was such a close game. It came down to the last play of the game, one second left on the clock. What were you thinking at the end of the game? Actually, it felt great because coming into the game, you know, we had to move a lot of players around due to weight restrictions and everything. So we had guys who were playing positions they normally don't play during the season. But that just goes to show the depth and the character of our kids because they never got discouraged going in. And the quarterback, Jamal, who threw the winning touchdown, he's been like a vocal leader for us throughout the entire year. He's like one of the most, he might be one of the smallest on the team, but he is definitely one of the most respected kids in our entire program. So I felt great to watch him throw that touchdown and to know that the coaching staff had that much confidence to put it on his shoulders. I didn't just want to say a whole lot about the entire team this season. You mentioned your quarterback and the, the last play the receiver was able to get wide open and that was Johnson. Yes. Diajuan, yes. I believe is how we say it. So he caught the touchdown from Jamal Cooney. When you're playing a team, Kendall, Colts who are very good too. They're a champion in their own yes. right in their league. And you're coming into this. How was practice this week? Because you said you had to move some players around, obviously, because of the weight requirements and all. So what was that like And just trying to keep the kids focused and, and so they know that, hey, playing different positions, but come on, we got to do this. Well, to be honest, this week, right, our team, our practices sometimes are uneven. For whatever reason, this group of kids, they're gamers. But on practice field, if you were to come out and watch what our practices, scout our practices, you would think we're going to get blowed out. But it's on game day when the lights go on, that's when we step up and rise to the occasion. So. Has there ever been more exciting game that you've been involved in in all your years coaching? Oh uh, man, let me tell you something. There was a game some years ago while I was coaching the Miami Gardens Chargers back in 2007. We were at the actual original Orange Bowl. And that meant a lot to us because that was a televised game. And we were playing a bigger team from the round. And they had a long winning streak. And we had a long winning streak. So it was like a collision of superpowers. And we jumped out to a 20 to 6 lead. And it's like as the game wound down, we ended up losing 23 to 20. But sometimes you learn more about yourself as a team and as a staff from a loss than you do as an actual victim. Coach Travis, thank you so much. Nice job this season.